wonder if he knows he's being filmed. Hey. Hey. <laughs> What's happening? We're cutting uh, seals to windows so we can get the windows out. Get out of town. Yeah, because we can't just seal over Speak up. Uh, the old seals. Boring. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty boring. <laughs> <laughs> and how, be... how long is this taking? <laughs> This is gonna take a while. This is the long, the longest process. But you have a hell of a cheering section. See that? I did all that. <laughs> so what tool did we discover that was much oh, more efficient? Okay. Let's look at this! One, two. So we started off doing this with a blade. Um, just taking it off very, uh... Was that a good idea or a bad idea? It was a good idea if that's all you have. It was a slow have, idea. But, um, <laughs> our neighbor, um, mentioned that he had uh, a pneumatic, um, I don't, know, this, I don't know what this is. I guess this is specifically used to take out windows. Um, so this, um, this cuts the caulking or, what was it, urethane? Sure. This takes the urethane and, uh, Turns into Smokes. a really easy job. Smokes. All right, so how was yesterday? Yesterday was good. Sir messy. Tyler. Um, we took all the windows out. I'll go take a tour. Take a look. So um, we had the one tool, uh, the the window remover tool, um, and we were trying to scrape out uh, the residual leftover. All that uh, crap. Adhesive. We do have to clean the windows today too. I didn't do that yesterday. Yeah, okay. We don't so, have to grind the windows, do we? Hey! It's just another attachment um, for a wire brush. Right, right. Um, it's pneumatic as well. And that, that cut our time down significantly. Oh my goodness. From what? <laughs> like, what was it taking? Probably a good half an hour per window, right? Yeah, I don't know. Well, with that one tool, yeah. Yeah. yeah so it's always good to have the right tool for the job. <laughs> for the right price! Yeah, free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was pretty good. <laughs> and we're racing against time, although you can't tell right now, but there is a mighty, the mighty Niagara Falls storm. So there's Niagara Falls down there. It is coming. So, so what's the plan today? Get the windows intact. <laughs> what's the plan today? Let's oh, let's test out this camera. This is our new camera, by the way. It has. Oh, I can't get in the bus. Could you open the bus for me? Sure. <laughs> The, the camera has this uh, built-in steadiness. Yeah. Uh, that was me. I cleaned that. <laughs> uh, oh, we got to return that, too. Yeah, don't get one of those. Yeah, don't do it. If you're ever renovating a bus and think you need something, think about it twice. Yeah. <laughs> Paint 
So what are some important things to remember? While it's mask. Mask and glasses. Drink glasses <laughs> Next time we'll remember those. All of these optional. If you want to live long and prosperous, do as I don't. Polyurethane, yeah. Polyurethane. There's a bottle yeah. right here. Yeah, yeah. And there's all the, uh, probably, how old do you think that polyurethane would be? As old as the truck, so. So, yeah, pretty, uh, 20 pretty old. Year, 20 years. So, it's pretty good to get that out. Um, <clears throat> we've noticed a lot of just rust, and all the water was just coming through the old polyurethane, just dripping down and causing. Uh, a lot of issues. Um, but anyway, so that's about what we did today um, and what we're going to be doing in the future as we're working in between doing this. Um, we definitely need to get our auxiliary tank installed, so I've been working on researching, 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 so hopefully we found two places that might be able to do it. Um, that would be great. We're also having some um, issues with our transmission so we're going to have to take a look at that it'll be another punch in the gut for money that we aren't planning um, but we can always hold off on certain things like the roof um what are we to doing to the roof fancy pants stuff to the roof like what um, well we're throwing around some ideas like the faux tin um so it has a nice that's the that's the ceiling. tin tile yeah yeah although today i was at lowe's and they had almost like an embossed um, wallpaper, which was pretty cool mm. as well. So it looks the exact same as the mm -hmm. faux tin, except we'd be able to uh, create some kind of uh, heat loss prevention mm. on the roof by putting proper insulation. Yes, yes, why not so, do that? Yeah, so yeah. We're, we're doing some, we can cut that down. Like there's so many things that we can do later uh, because it's clearly pretty good weather right now. So what's the point of you know, yeah. fill in the roof if we've got transmission issues. So, exactly. anyways, steps at a time. Step at a time and don't step on wet polyurethane. No. Because then you're like this. <laughs> <laughs> if you stand there for six to eight hours, then it's dried. And you wobble around <laughs> like this. Then we gotta, then we gotta cut around my foot. <laughs> or just step out of the, the sandal. <laughs> I'm gonna go. What's going on? I'm gonna go find my glasses case in the in the storm. Hopefully I can see them. Hopefully it doesn't get too dark. Oh my god. Yeah. I'll be back. Ah, ah.